Greetings and welcome back to Berlin. Uh, I hope wherever you are, you're doing great. And today we are doing the burger dance. That's because we did the uh, Burgermeister review uh, a couple weeks ago and it seemed to be pretty popular. And we're gonna look at the east and west version, or not versions, but a good burger on the east side of Berlin and a good one on the west side of Berlin. I happen to live in Charlottenburg, uh, which is on the west side. And it's actually the home to a number of notable restaurants. People I know from around the city come to this part of town for a couple that we'll share with you. One half a block away is Lone Men's Noodle House. And I know we had that special that Sam was doing uh, previously on the handmade noodles. Um, and they do the same thing here. This You can call this maybe a little like China Row in a way, because right down um, half a block on the corner is Aroma. And actually some of my restaurant tour friends have been known to bring their staff here for celebrations. So that says a lot for Aroma. Just across the street from that is El Borquito. El Borquito. El Borquito. And tell me about El Borquito. Because I, I mentioned this. Taxi, and the taxi driver told me, he said that even when he made no one cent, yeah. he would go in the night, like two o'clock in the evening, he would go there and have something nice. Even, yeah, when he had nothing at all. Because this is what? This is like a freaking awesome Spanish or look at this now I was here earlier today and we got a, an idea of this but this is like the first day out of jail and like the people I mean it's it's it I, I don't want to get too close but El Borriquito um the Ecar is like nice. yeah it really is so it's a, I mean they always have music there and they play for you and uh, you feel really like in Spain this is what this uh, Spanish people say like this is a kind of place where they feel home. was the was the uh, taxi driver Spanish Okay, just checking. <laughs> and here, just a hop, skip, and a jump, maybe a couple of blocks from the places that we just showed you on Kahnstrasse, is Pestalozzi Strasse, and it's littered with really wonderful little restaurants. This, for one, is Biscotti, a favorite of one of my really good friends. And here, just as the markets are breaking up in front of the church and on Pestalozzi Strasse, it brings us to our west side, or west side of the city burger destination, which is Burger Berlin. Uh, found this, it's not uh, particularly popular or written up. It's like, I find, I think it's like really kind of a little hidden treasure. Uh, again, it's on a street littered with a number of restaurants. We've got a little Mexican cantina here, a more traditional German. And just down the street brings us to our destination, Burgers Berlin. Yeah. Huh? Hello, we got you welcome. Welcome, good. Okay. Okay, we're back. This is uh, Burger Berlin, and this is Burger in, Berlin, yes. right. And this is my Keats. This is where I live. Okay. And uh, there are a lot of things that you, you guys don't come up on like the the best, but I think you really are very, very, very good. I like I've been here before, and I think it's excellent. So I think I I I always usually get the um, the chili cheeseburger. Chili, chili cheese, uh, hot stuff burger. Yeah, I cannot. We have the uh, salad uh, here is the hot stuff. You want hot stuff burger? Hot stuff burger. Okay, with cheese and chili and beef. And beef? And and yeah, exactly. And bacon? Bacon. We can, can I put, add bacon yeah, to that? Yeah, awesome. Bacon, awesome. Yes. And then Christina? Uh, what? Uh, well, I like something with cheese. Like, like a cheese burger or? Cheesy cheese, yes? Yes, cheesy Oh, cheesy cheese. cheese. Oh, okay. okay. What's the name of your cracker? Cracker Avenue. Cracker Avenue. It's small, we just started. Like no problem. It's like step by step. Step by step. Yeah. What about a wagon? Right. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. That is our history. Yeah, I'm not going to use this one. You work in cheese store, yeah? Yeah. Okay. No. Now you come to the 
I always, especially for the burgers, because I feel like I'm in more in my wheelhouse here. It's not Dooner, it's not Curry Wars, it's like I'm at, like, but here I'm in my wheelhouse and I need like to give it a chance to like settle in a little bit and this burger like overall I mean like Burgermeister I like the bread there I like the brioche kind of flavor to it but this is like they, they, they killed it with the quality of the beef is good I mean it's you can taste you can taste the beef in it a little bit more I think um, I like the kartoffel and I this is always my uh, I, I go back to this all the time I'm not a fry guy but here we go I'm gonna eat a fry but the Seuss kartoffel is like really pretty good um, but anyway these guys will knock it knock it out of the park with this burger once again it's like if you're on this side of town and you're here shopping or if you're just walking around or if you live in the area come on by it's good.